What's up guys? So this past week we got some really unfortunate news for the Detective Pikachu movie franchise. Because Detective Pikachu started trending on Twitter and with it trending there was also some unfortunate news that resurfaced along with it. And I guess no one ever really noticed this news when it dropped originally last year because I know that I definitely never heard anything about it. Anyways the news that resurfaced is for the sequel to the movie of course and apparently there was confirmation back in March of last year year by Justice Smith who played the lead role in Detective Pikachu. He confirmed that the sequel for this movie was officially scrapped, which honestly is very upsetting news to fans everywhere because it was an absolutely wonderful movie in my personal opinion and regardless it left fans dying to see more live action versions of their favorite Pokemon. And though I wasn't exactly sure how they could have continued with the actual Detective Pikachu title given how the last movie ended, it's still so shocking that they scrapped the movie because it made over 400 million dollars. To put it in perspective, which is over 100 million more than the Sonic movie, which is already getting a sequel by the way. And with Detective Pikachu, I feel like that amount of money more than warrants a sequel and some spin-offs, which given how the story of this movie went, it could literally focus on anything. And given how this movie focused on Mewtwo, maybe they could do a spin-off that has Pokemon Rangers trying to help Rayquaza stop Groudon and Kyogre from fighting. Fighting. But anyways, I was really hoping for a sequel to this movie because I feel like there is so much potential for a live action Pokemon franchise. And I covered my thoughts on potential sequels to Detective Pikachu in my last video if you're interested. But with that news, thankfully there is a live action series being developed for Netflix, which hopefully will reference Detective Pikachu in one way or another, though whether it will be good or not is still up in the air. I personally hope that the Netflix show will end up following the character that we saw at the beginning of the movie, who looked an awful lot like Red, who is the protagonist of the very first Pokemon games. And unlike with a movie franchise, a show will actually be able to follow a protagonist through their gym challenge if they decided to go down that route. But honestly, I just hope that they don't decide to make yet another live action anime adaptation, because yes, I love the Pokemon anime, I mean I grew up watching it, but I am sick and tired of seeing only Ash. I want to see the Pokemon world through more than just his eyes, which is why I personally really enjoy the Generations series as well as the other spin-offs like Poketune that they have done. Because not focusing on Ash like they've done for the past god knows how long is what makes it really enjoyable. Because yes, I do love the anime, but I grew up watching it and all that we've ever seen really is things through Ash's eyes. And I think that this is a perfect opportunity to give us a different perspective. But at the end of the day, who knows what the show will end up being like. I know that I will still end up watching it regardless. And with that being said, let me know your thoughts. How do you feel about the news of Detective Pikachu 2 being cancelled? And while you're down there, let me know what your expectations for the Netflix series are and what do you hope that they will do with it. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and hopefully I'll catch you in the next one.